Is that what you do? That the cool kids do? No, you do this, Gav. Oh, that's so cute. How was the Black Friday sales for you? Yeah, it's been busy. Did you buy anything on Black Friday? And that's what I meant. Did you buy anything? What did you buy on Black Friday? Nothing. Not a thing? No, I let myself down. What? There wasn't really much around, was there? No, and I didn't buy anything. No. I just treated myself. Cyber Monday, though. What's Cyber Monday? What's that all about? Well... Electronics, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is. And obviously, would you say I watch the electronic? I would. Well, it, You know, mm. you can put it in category you don't have to. Curious. 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 Because I said to you, Let's not unbox a Rolex, and you've shoved a Rolex box yeah, in my sorry, face. Yeah, sorry, but this. Yeah. This T H I S is. Yes. Looks like speechless. Let's take a look, shall we? Hi guys, welcome back. Welcome back indeed. It's Cyber Monday and we've got a watch. No electronics here. We've got a, oh it's quite heavy. We've got a Rolex box. But I did say to you, I mean, and I did say, and we've got another watch to actually unbox because I did say to you, let's not do Rolex for a change. So why have you pulled out a Rolex box? And by the way, why are we not out with the green box? Because? Um, because. Why have we got the outer cover? Don't open it. Yeah. Don't open it. This Gav, I thought this is just, come in with from a customer right um we just got it from a bit a minute i know what it is okay i didn't even say anything no but i know i do you know why i know what it is because if you've made a big song and dance about this there's one watch that i've been dying to see that you have not had in it's the rainbow daytona i'm gonna guess it's the rainbow daytona or would that be in a bigger box yeah this? that would be like large oh large. so it's not a rainbow daytona it's not damn so yeah. Shall I show you? Yeah, go, let's go. Okay. I'm going to show you Gav first, guys, and then we'll show you. It's green. Okay. Oh! Oh, wow! That's... Oh! It's different. It's different. So, guys, and look at here, Gav. So, well, guys, as you can time. see, this is the Deep Sea Challenge. Hold on, Deep Sea Challenge. It is, and it's printed in the back. Yeah, which and obviously I think, and the reason I believe they've done that is because obviously there used to be a flap here, yeah. but they can't because obviously the watch is yeah. so large. Yeah. That's amazing. Oh, so, so then they've done the it bottom. at the bottom, which I think I quite like actually, to be honest. That is kind of cute, isn't it? Yeah. You've got a deep sea challenge. Yeah. Let's pop that over there. So wow. this is wow. the, the big boy. <gasps> oh my God, it is large. It, Look at it, that deep sea challenge. I know. 23, uh, 2603. 2012, it's got the dates in the back. I really like that, and I think it, I like the fact that it corresponds just to that watch and only that watch. <laughs> it's so funny, actually. <laughs> it's so funny seeing it. Where's the fake one we had? Oh, yeah. um, we should have brought that in. It is. Um... No, but I tell you what, I did bring it in. Oh, what did you bring in? Just grab it. I actually brought in a James Cameron, guys, just so that we can actually, go you know, compare. yes, go compare.com. Well, let's have a look. Let's go compare. I mean already, it's insane. The side of the case, the bezel, the face, wow. the glass, the bracelet. Oh my god, I mean it's like super size me. Yeah, it's like for a magnifying glass. Exactly, you hold on to that little puppy for a second, let's get it on. This must look stupid on Spencer, surely. Yeah, so it's just so I've got tiny. To tell you, I know it's titanium, but it is very heavy. Is it? Yeah, it's heavy, what feel it? I don't know what I'm saying, is it? Yeah. It is heavy, isn't it? But, but look, I, I think I feel like that's heavier. Really? No, uh, well, maybe. Mm, maybe. So. Obviously, way too big for me. Um, oh, you know why it's way too big? Obviously, because it goes over diving suits. Yes. <gasps> oh, look at that! Huge. What do you think, honestly? Honest, honest thoughts, first impressions. What do you think? Honest impressions, absolutely never going to be for me. In the nicest possible way. What this is for me is an absolute showpiece. It's an absolute um, it is huge, no? something to have. Listen, I'm never going to be diving. Cool, I'm never going to be diving at three thousand feet. What? I think you'll die at three thousand feet. Yeah. Um, what can I say about this other than that it's literally supersized, and I'm a supersized sort of fella. Now they haven't said that this is limited, but you get the feeling that there's not so many of these going to come through. And also, I think if there, there isn't that many people, that 
it's not like this, James Cameron, where everyone might get one. Holding this now, Gav, makes it look tiny. That is insane. Hold that. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you, I see what you mean about the weight. Yeah. You're absolutely right. But now looking at it, it looks tiny. I mean, it really is. Well, the, f the thing is, I guess, is the actual, the face itself, comparatively speaking, is the same size. It's just the case structure yeah. that makes it look so absolutely, you know what it is? In burger terms, it's a Whopper XL double. So a customer's brought it into us to have a look at, which is quite cool. Beautiful. Um, so yeah. So we're not sure if this is going to be for sale, but for, for the moment, we get a chance to get our paws all and over it. And I wanted to show the viewers first, they're so the yeah. main people. It is a chunky monkey, look at yeah. that, unbelievable. And on the back, once again, Mariana Trench, 23rd of the 1st, 1960, 26th of the 3rd, 2012. And it's got the three Rolex crowns on the back as well. You'll be able to see that after. Should we have a little listen to the click? It always does me. lovely. I'll tell you what I do like actually, looking at the watch really closely, let's get that lined up or someone will go <laughs> mad, um, is the, the steel around the actual yeah. dial looks really really nice and really does set it up, it really does look quite sort of sparkly. I do brand. think it suits being in titanium you know. Yeah, well I guess it needs to be because of the weight yeah. and that's the um, gas escape valve there yeah. and I wonder how it undoes it, does it just pull out and it's a long way to unscrew it. A stunner. No, no yeah. price on this piece. No, not at the moment. Sorry, guys. That's but... all right. But what I would say is that um, if anybody's interested in sourcing uh, a watch like this, they can just call me. Yeah. I mean, we always source watches for customers. So if there is anything that you might not, that's not on our website, but you'd like, just give us a call, um, and I'll do my best to source one for yeah. you. Yeah. I mean, specifically this. Yeah, I mean, if anybody is looking for this, please give me a call. Yeah, I mean, absolutely. or Spencer, yeah. you know, we'll see what we can do for you. Absolutely. Brilliant. See you on the next one. Bye, guys.